Production Management Intern. I'm Andrea Healy and I'm the Scenic Artist Intern. Hi, I'm Aim Vesa and I'm the Scene Shop Intern. Hi, my name is Pamela Wilcox and I'm the Costume Intern. My name is Kimberly Watt and I am the Company Management Intern. Hi, my name is Brittany Calgill and I'm the Audio Intern. My name is Christy Banker, I'm the Dramaturgy Intern. Hi, my name is Tamika Dare and I'm the Graphics Intern. Hi, I'm Katie Rumbaugh. I was the former development intern and now development assistant. Hi, I'm Maria Mendoza. I'm the properties intern. Hello, my name is Patrick Stengel and I am the marketing intern. Tim Helmer, front of house intern. I'm Kevin James and I am the community programs and education intern. I'm Jen Reiser and I'm the electrics intern. Hi, my name is Cody Swines. I am the stage management intern on Let There Be Love. My name is Katie Ambrose, and I am the stage management intern. Hi, I'm Sarah Weissman, and I'm the public relations intern. I'm Katie, I'm the wardrobe intern at Center Stage. I think the most valuable part of this internship is being exposed to as many working professionals in theater as possible. We get to do a full 40 hour a week job, and yet we don't have the pressures of having to deal with an apartment and utilities because that is thankfully covered for us. You're not in a job that you can't leave. It's something temporary, but it's still something that you can take the time and decide if this is what you want to do. I think the most valuable part um, for me interning is being able to work with amazing designers and technicians and um, people and um, getting the chance to learn something new every day at work. Well, one of the reasons I took the internship um, was so that I could gain the confidence I needed to someday have a full-time position and so I came here and after a few short months I definitely got to that place I needed to be. I definitely feel like I've gotten a feel for how a professional theater works, um, gotten some real-world experience as opposed to just the school stuff um, and I've gotten to see how you deal with an aspect that you don't really deal with at school which is the general public. I really enjoy working with all the kids that I get to work with. I get to work with the encounter students. I get to work with kids in high schools and public schools and private schools all throughout the city. It's, it's a lot of fun getting to go out and play theater games with kids. Every day you're doing things that people in the real world do and it's just more and more practice, you know? What I find most valuable, I think, is just the professional quality of work that we do here. I've worked at other places before where that hasn't been quite as much of a priority or it just hasn't happened in the same way and I feel like that's one of its greatest assets. There's a lot of communication and there's a lot of people wanting to work together and wanting to be part of a team and I feel like that's important and valuable and I really enjoy that here. It's kind of a stereotype of the intern to make coffees and get coffee and I feel like I'm doing work that's really creatively fulfilling and I feel like I'm really respected as a staff member here and not just an intern. Center Stage is like a second family to me because I've never been in a place where the people are as, as passionate about the arts as I am. But I think the biggest thing is probably just like knowing you can do it and that your world won't fall apart when you're working crazy hours in the arts and making almost no money because you work with wonderful people. Well, I hope to keep in touch with all the other interns because you guys are pretty awesome and stuff like that. Um, but again, I hope to keep some of the contacts I've made, um, hopefully stay in touch with some of the designers that have come through. Um, and I've learned a lot about the Baltimore area. Like, I've found this to be a great artsy fun town and want to stick around. It's been fun. <laughs> <laughs>